This is the uh, Giant Simple 3. Pretty nice bike. It's huge. I bought this uh, used from uh, some guy on Facebook. He uh, barely rode it. It looks brand new. They retail for around $570 new. I uh, negotiated the price down to $370. This is not my first bike. I uh, actually bought this one because I broke my other bike. I bought a cheap bike from Academy a couple of years ago. Now it's broken. Um, I decided to invest a little bit more money and got, got me a real bike. This one's painted in matte black. Handlebars are pretty good. Yeah, it's a pretty sick looking bike. I like the rear trunk, the rear rack. It's got a internal um, gears, three gears. It's not a fast bike, but I wanted more of a comfortable bike. I'm a, I'm a fat ass, so you know, my ass can't handle those skinny mountain bike uh, seats. But yeah, uh, 300, $350 used. They sell them for about $570 new. So, not a bad deal. Pretty comfortable bike. Already uh, bought accessories for it. It's going to come here tomorrow. Uh, bought a, a trunk bag so I can carry some stuff with me when I'm out biking with my wife um, the only thing that I would change on it is the seats it's not very comfortable you know it's a standard seat uh, not much uh, padding on it this part hurts but you see it's very cheaply made pretty disappointing for a uh, $570 MSRP bike Other than that uh, the drive trains are a little noisy on third gear uh, the Paint quality uh, It scratches pretty easily to be honest with you, you know when I bought it new from the guy When I bought it used from the guy I didn't have a lot of scratches But now I started using it. It's got more scratches so uh, Look at this The welds look pretty good. The brakes are okay. You need, you know, you just gotta get used to it because it's all um, I don't, I forgot what it's called, but it's it's not the uh, the hand brakes. Just gotta get used to it. Fenders look good. This one is meant for a big boy, so if you want something comfy and you're in a bigger size, this would be the bike to get, or something like this. There's another bike that looks exactly like this. I think it's called the, uh, fuck, what is it called? The 360 in the barrel. Um, that one is cheaper than this bike, but it's not as nice. So, let me show you guys my old bike. see if this is open all right so that bike I broke I bought this thing for $130 from Academy a couple of years ago I mean I just fucking stripped the uh, the pedals either that or it was just installed wrong I think uh, I think it was cross threaded I mean it's not a bad bike but oh my god the seat is so uncomfortable and the gears are shit but for a $130 bike, it's not bad. I'm actually going to give this one away. Now my wife's bike, this is one of those Walmart doorbuster bikes. It's, it's a complete piece of shit. Don't ever waste your money on those doorbuster bikes from Walmart, you know, on Black Friday. Waste of money. It's probably better if you just, I don't know, don't waste your money on those. Anyway, that's it.